In one way or another, artificial intelligence is becoming part of our daily lives, and that now includes on our highways. Good afternoon. I'm Natalie Wilson. And I'm Neil McNeil. The North Carolina Highway Patrol is now using AI to identify distracted commercial drivers. It's been in place since the spring, covering the eastern, western, and central parts of the state. Fox 8 Celeste Smith has been on this story today. She joins us now live in Greensboro with more Celeste. So the devices are placed on high traffic roads for commercial vehicles and the, they will take images of the commercial drivers in violation of the hands free law. The photo will be taken and sent to state troopers and I spoke with truck drivers who say that if this tool keeps people safe, then they're all for it. Being an advocate and being in the truck for over 20 years, I mean, I've seen a lot of bad things when people are distracted. NC Highway Patrol is using three AccuSenses heads up solution devices placed across the state along I 40. The cameras are only monitoring commercial drivers and will take photos of the passing truck's plates and capture images of the driver inside the cab. It is looking for hands free and seatbelt violations. Unlike passenger vehicle drivers, commercial drivers have to be hands free at all times when driving. We can only drive 11 hours. We have to sleep a mandatory of 10 hours. We have to take a mandatory 30 minute break after an eight hour period and everything's different for us. The AI devices are mobile and can be relocated. Plus, there's no schedule for where they're placed. I think it'll be an excellent implement in trying to catch distracted driving. As we know, it's all a huge problem now with people on phones and things like that. So I think it'll be a good I think it'll be a good help for everybody. Some though are on the fence about the devices. Do I think it's needed? Yes and no. I mean, you got a lot of people that's been out here that's been doing this for a long time, and that's, you know, kind of we got to use our phones while we're driving, you know, not all the time to be texting and driving, but, you know, to check for more work. A state trooper sits in a location past the device and will get an alert within seconds when there is a violation, and they can pull up the photo and review it. If there is evidence of a violation, they will stop the truck as it passes. Fines up to $100 could be issued. A spokesperson with State Highway Patrol said last week in the Hickory area, in a 30 minute period, they had more than five violations. Commercial drivers said they also hope to see something similar used to monitor passenger vehicle drivers in violation of texting and driving and not wearing seat belts. It'll be a great implement for starting out with the trucking industry and then I hope it can filter down to everybody. We're more worried about the people driving on the road than us. You know, this is what we do for a living. The photos taken by the devices will not be shared with any other agency outside of North Carolina Highway Patrol, and the total cost of the three devices being used is $495,000. Live in Greensboro, Celeste Smith, Fox 8 News.